Oh, I can't believe I'm dreaming this. That's awful. Uh, Earth? What's wrong with you? I had a scary dream, like a hole was forming in you. Nah, that's insane. It's impossible. What dream are you talking about? There's a hole in you! <laughs> what the f- Earth! Earth! Earth, what shall we do? Why are you like this? Uh, I don't know. I thought that's impossible. Hey, Earth! Uh, I've got an idea. What if pieces of you decided to become planets in their own right? Turns out they're flying and playing somewhere near us right now. Moon, are you really that dumb? What's this nonsense? Well, it can't be that there's just a hole inside you. Of course it can't, but if the gravitational field... Alright, all right, I get it. Don't start with the... Uh, uh, and what that might be. Earth? Step right there! Hey, Earth, I told you! What the hell? What, what is this? How is this? I'm starting to feel dumb. <laughs> Turns out I was right. First time I agree with you. Moon, since you were such an overmind today, maybe you still know how I can get these pieces back. Well, I don't know. Maybe they need to fly into your hole. But how do you make them do that? Phew, you're still dumb, Moon. Why force them when I can do it myself? Phew, lucky you, Earth. Yeah, I'd be even luckier if I didn't know you. You can't even help in the irresponsible situation. Learn, instead of giving dumb advice. Earth, you have two choices. What are they? Either apologize, or go fuck. You have a lot to learn about us, about our universe and the other characters. Yes, I literally can't wait to meet and get to know you all. What's going on? I myself have no idea. Why are the stones flying up? What? Why are they shaking and screaming? Huh? And I'm shaking as well. What? We have to quickly get away from here! At least from the Kuiper Belt, or the rocks will kill us! Let's go! <laughs> Come on, a little bit left! Uh, I've never been this far from the rocks, but as I can see, they're as endless as I thought they were. No! We've almost got to the end! <sighs> it was so close! What kind of shaking was that? We have to check other planets just in case something happened. Keep up, especially you, Planet 9! We need to figure out what's going on! Neptune, hi! What's going on? Why are we all shaking? I don't understand either. I haven't seen anything extraordinary in the outskirts of our system. I don't even know what could have happened. It could be an explosion of the sun, but he's over there. Oh, and who are you? It's Planet 9! We found you in the Kuiper Belt! Well, I didn't think there was anybody else there but that psycho Pluto. By the way, where could it be now? If he's at the Kuiper Belt now, he must have been crushed by asteroids, since we barely got away from there. There are rocks flying in different directions, and Earth helped us to get through them. Yes, I had to do everything to help us get away from danger. Luckily, we were not hurt. Well, we need to keep going. Be careful, Neptune. Come on, let's go! What's really going on, I wonder? Oh my... Mars, what the hell is going on here? Maybe your dumb head knows. What? Who are you calling dumb, you smarty pants? And who's that? This is Planet Nine, our friend. He's been living not too far from us all this time. Well, it must be all his fault. While he was not here, everything was fine. And now you it has brought him to us, and that's what happened. Huh? What? Why is he so rude? It's impossible that all this happened because of me. No way. Moreover, the shaking began when we were at my place. Sure, it's nonsense. This mean ball with no soul is always yelling at everyone. Never mind him. Guys! Run! What the hell is that? Is it a black hole? But what's going on with it? Why is it so big and trying to swallow our system? I don't care what it is, but apparently we have to get out of here. So what do we do now? Where should we go? I don't know, but for now as far away as possible. Huh, I don't even know what to do. It would be great to protect ourselves, or just be able to instantly run away to another place and take our whole system with us. It's possible to do that on me. Yeah, that sounds interesting. Can we get that thing? Yes, I'd love to get it as well. I would have probably been on a space beach by now. Yeah, that'd be cool. Enough, I'm just shocked. Are you really that dumb? We were almost eaten a moment ago, and you dream of beaches. We must think about what to do. I already understood that 
he's rude, but he's kind of right. We really need to do something. I have an idea. We need to go to the black hole. What? Are you serious? We just escaped from it and it's obviously dangerous for us to go back. I'm talking about another black hole. There's more than one. And it's very strange that a black hole began exploding. As far as I know, they can't explode. So we need to find another black hole. Oh, I know where we can find one. The one we met when we visited exoplanets. Then lead the way. Sounds dangerous, but I'm in. <laughs> ah, you look so scary. Please don't eat us. Don't worry, he's our friend. What? I'm no friend to such worthless bottles. Maybe I should just eat you and that's it. Black hole, wait! We saw a black hole just like you, but several times bigger trying to eat our whole system. It looks like it's about to explode, but you guys don't do that. What? A huge black hole trying to eat everything. I don't believe you. Come with us! Look! What? It's my brother! What's going on with you? He's done for! I also think so! Me too! Brother, what's happening to you? Not to say that I feel sorry for this system, but if you continue, you'll swallow everything! Stop it! Well, I say it's so ironic. We all need some popcorn to enjoy the show. I agree! What's going on with you? Huh? Maybe you're sleepwalking again. Wake up, wake up, wake up. Listen, Earth, maybe you can tell us about Black House a little more. It'd be interesting to learn about them. Yeah, I sure will. Why can't they explode? The black hole itself is a dead star that simply can't explode. Nothing can happen to it. It can withstand almost anything. So there's nothing in the space that can harm him. As for us, it's very dangerous for us to be near it. It changes time and space. For example, if it was near me, I simply would have been torn apart and become a ring for a black hole. Just like the rings that rotate around Saturn. It would have taken a black hole just a few days to swallow most of me. Well, I guess you're the smartest one here, right? No, I'm the smartest one here. Mars, shut up. Brother, get up. Why are you still sleeping? Huh? Where am I? And what's going on here? You've been sleepwalking again. Go home and give planets back to the system. Oh, okay. Yeah, now let's go. What? It was that easy? Yeah, even I got scared. Why do you always have such shit going on? <laughs> Space newspapers are really interesting these days. Hello, Earth. Hi, Venus. Wait just a moment. I need to finish reading the last sentence. And... I'm done. You wanted to ask something, or do you just want to chat? Yeah, I have a question. But then we can talk, of course. Ask away, then. What are you waiting for? Well, sorry for a stupid question, but why am I so slow? Huh? What do you mean? I noticed that I'm the slowest, and Jupiter is the fastest. But you can't tell by looking at him. Huh, yeah, Jupiter's just pretending to be slow. But when he needs to, he's so fast. You should have seen him when he went into the black hole. It was something. So yeah, I was just reading about all this in the newspaper. So what can you tell me? Lately, I gained the speed of rotation. No one can explain why this happens, but there's speculation that this is due to the misalignments of my geographic poles. I really hope that this won't lead to anything bad. What? Does this mean that if you spin faster, I will spin faster as well? Good question, guys. But I can't say that. Don't tell us too much. Just tell us what you know. God, there are so many words. Well, first shut up, Venus. I'm talking here if you need answers. I'll say once again that I don't know if the moon will spin faster if I spin faster. But now you are spinning faster and I seem to keep up with you. Well, yeah, everything's okay then. The most important thing is that I don't stop because in this case, it'll be the end of the world. And you may crash into me because I'll lose gravity and air. And many other bad things may happen. As long as everything's okay, I don't have anything to worry about. What a genius you are. You asked for it. <laughs> It's total bullshit. <clears throat> it's crazy. I didn't think I or the whole exosystem would have to live with you all together. Come on, we're friends. It'll be fine. We'll help each other and we won't be bored. Yeah, I wish it was like that. Look, you really are beautiful. Why am I not like you? What? You're even better looking than me. No, it's weird to hear such words from me, but you really look better than me. <laughs> Come on. Well, two idiots found each other. Okay, let's figure out how to help us get out of your system, because I don't really want to live with you all. You're so mean! We would have helped you anyway! Then help us, what are you waiting for? Huh, so what can my theory about colliding galaxies tell me? 
As far as I know, if they collided, we would just become one big galaxy. But what can we do to make the exosystem leave and go somewhere? Only with the help of black hole. But it's dangerous to play with it. If we encountered a big black hole, it would swallow the whole system. What? A big black hole! Exactly! Earth, are you okay? It might not have been a collision. They might just have been eaten by a black hole. No, that's nonsense. We saw a black hole. It's not so big to swallow our whole system. Maybe it can swallow the planet, but not the sun. It's literally impossible. What an idiot you are. What did you say? Have you seen yourself in the mirror? I hope you at least know what it is. What did you say? You think I don't know what a mirror is? I've seen it more times in my life than you've seen stars. You don't say? Well, I didn't know your Mars is rude as well. I don't understand one thing. If your Sun and ours have almost the same character, Mars and Texo Mars are also the same. Why are you so nasty and I'm not? I don't know, I'm just smarter. I see. Okay. Let's continue the topic. So you could have been swallowed by a huge black hole. You're flying right next to the sun. And the black hole could fly up to you and suck you in. Because of its size, you might not even notice it. No matter how stupid it sounds, maybe it was so big that it didn't see its borders and thought it was just space. Huh. That is quite a theory. Do you guys know why there is a big spot flying towards us that you can't even see the stars? We're screwed! Thanks for watching! Don't forget to like and subscribe! By the way, there's a new video!